Cruise is a product that's really very close to my heart. Uh, I started here at Boss in 2004, and it was the first product that we developed. The concept itself was created by David, the designer, maybe two years, just over two years in advance of that. He presented it to me at the company that I was previously working for. I loved the concept immediately, but knew that it really wasn't relevant, it didn't fit in the portfolio that I was managing at that stage. Fast forward two years later, I've started here at Boss, remembered the concept, but hadn't seen it launched under any other company name. Cruise, in a lot of ways, really still represents what we're trying to do with the, with the wider portfolio. You know, we're not trying to create products that shout too loudly. We're trying to create products with a, an enduring, almost timeless appeal aesthetically, but you know, ones that are sophisticated and refined and aren't scary to specify. You know, products that you feel to a certain extent like you've already lived with and will be living with for generations to come. You can clearly see that whilst Cruise kind of stands up as a, as a credible modern design, it's part of a, of a furniture design lineage, both British and international, that, uh, that it just it finds its place in really very comfortably. Cruise was conceived at a time when the market, certainly here within the UK, was moving away from tub chairs. Tub chairs had been the go-to uh, solution as far as uh, single seat uh, waiting and, and more open collaborative spaces as they were starting to emerge in those days. And people were moving from a, a heavy look where it was generally kind of almost upholstery down to the floor to something which was an altogether lighter aesthetic, something that was raised up on a, usually a central pedestal base and importantly something that was flexible enough to dress up in a much broader number of ways to suit a broader number of environments. Keeping crews relevant has mostly been about uh, expanding the range of finishes that we've made available to those products. Aesthetically as a piece, Cruise has uh, an almost timeless aesthetic, but you have to continue to expand the range of finishes that's available. You have to be able to demonstrate that it works really well across a really broad range of fabrics, leathers, and wider finishes. You can make it very serious. You can have the black American walnut veneered outers, you know, with a beautiful clear lacquer on there. You can use the black and the tan leathers, and you can use polished bases and chrome parts, and you can make it feel very executive. Alternatively, down at the other end, you can start throwing incredible textures and soft fabrics and much more domestic feel. You can paint any of the, the base parts in any color of your choice, and you can start color blocking and contrasting and mixing and matching, really, to, to suit almost any environment this could go into. Space is culture, as we know, and a company's interior design, their workplace, is a physical manifestation of their brand. Specifying a product like Cruise with the enduring style that that brings represents a company's commitment to quality.